Hi, Super Perform. This is Daniel 1988. Um, once again, just with everything that's been going on, um, I meant to do this review way earlier, as in like a month or two earlier, but um, well, I guess better late than never. So, this is my Princess LE uh, from Ultra Sabers, obviously. Um, I, I'm sure a, a lot of uh, reviews have been done, so I w this won't necessarily be news to anyone. So I'll just kind of go over the features of mine. First is off. It's got the um, it's got the black AV switch. I got it in in the stunt setup um, as per my last several ones. As I've looked over my sabers, I found I just can't afford a lot of the sound sabers. So this one is going to be another um, to stunt saber. I got it in Sunrider's Destiny that color I just kind of wanted to go over a little bit of it uh, the features so for some reason I don't know if this is standard or what but um, when I got it it had the Covertech wheel right up here to me that's a little too high it swings a little too much of it out <laughs> that's the dogs in the background um, so, and so because it was too high, I took it off and just put the bolt back on it. Kind of gives it a nice little look. Um, it's another thin neck saber and I don't know if I can do it here, but I can't. But if you, uh, so I got mine with the, um, quick disconnects. So to get to the LED, which is about here, you have to take off this. Um, so this part comes off. Um, and one thing I did want to show you guys was this here. So just kind of as a heads up, um, I don't know if this would be better off with a, uh, with a tricre, but with the standard light, I, you probably can't tell from here. It is going to be very, it's not going to be as bright as, say, like this saber. It's my Empress here, Ellie here. Like you can tell it's pretty much brighter. This one is going to be a little bit duller. And I think it's because of this. Now, to be fair, there are windows in this part. You can see them along the sides. One there. One there. One there. So I think there's about three or four windows in this inner part but because I think of the metal not only of this outer part but because of this inner part which to be fair is to make it movie authentic um, it does make the color a bit duller I tr I've i tried this with um, I've tried it with the Deacon Silver I've tried it with um, Violet Amethyst I've tried it with um, Fire Orange, I've tried it with Sentinel Yellow, and all of them seem to be duller than your standard than your standard saber, which you would think it wouldn't matter. Um, like this one is not dull at all, even though it's also got inner um, inner uh, part in here, but for whatever reason, this the colors, just to give you a heads up, will be duller. Having said that, it's still a good saber. It's um, easily a one to two handed saber. I definitely like it a lot. Um, so my only real complaint was just that it, that the Covertech got mounted here instead of say here, and that's just a duller blade or duller color. Like I said, I think just because of this inner part here. Other than that, it was a perfectly good saber. I would highly recommend getting one, and um, I'm definitely going to enjoy mine for a while for a long time. So. So once again, this is Daniel1988, and this is my uh, Princess Ellie. Thank you very much.